I want to be better at catching this cycle, but fuck, it's kind of annoying. I love how fast it is to reset in this game. It takes, like, no time at all. It's fucking, like, ten seconds. It takes longer to load in the first level than it does to reset the run. So I just hug the left that entire time, that seems easier. Which uh, makes sense from a physics perspective. Crash teabag is only for new runs. Interesting. That's weird. <laughs> and it only happens on a new game. And only in the first level. Has to be a new save. Maybe it has something to do with the fact that it loads immediately into the first level. I don't know. <laughs> Busses me with good luck on my run. Dude, dude where's that been tonight? <laughs> I've been playing kind of kind of bad. I can just get away with it because I can still save almost five minutes off my run.
dope, babe. Oh, the, the fucking YouTube comment where someone was saying I was really whiny and I, like, agreed with them. I was like, yeah, what a fucking, uh, the fucking baby. Uh, someone else responded with, he thinks he's so cool with his stupid grin on his stupid face. Stupid. Enough with the speed runs already. Show off. Yeah, dude, I, I love messing with trolls like that. And just like general hateful comments anyway. I'm just like, yeah, man, you, you right. Fuck me. engine and brio banter is some of the best stuff it is dude brio's dialogue in the last hub with the fucking like the uh ding dong ding dong that shit is so funny the entire like the entirety of the last hub has just the, some of the best dialogue in the series How can someone resist how someone can resist the temptation of breaking crates? Easy, like this. Uh hello. That was cool, I guess. Oh, it's like for me, he had a marriage crush your dreams. Uh, we've all been there, dude. Doesn't seem like that marriage is going too hot for him, though. Lips like two overripe bananas, skin like a jaundiced mole rat, a bona fide ten. Wow, I lost time. The fuck. <laughs> Game is a giant community. It really is. It, it really is a very funny game. I'm sure Tiny will be back at some point. I've never hit that great. That is a new death to me. Oh, 
if they don't make an actual tiger. I think that I think they've learned not to fuck with the designs like Radical Entertainment tried to. Not to that degree, at least. <laughs> Fucking! That was the worst place to have nitro RNG. Literally, like right as I was going over it, it bounced up. safe a little slower without deaths and you got nah that's fucking weakness that's weakness we're going fast I mean I could take everything slow and just not die and I'll get record but the run will suck I'm trying to avoid uh, not dying becoming the meta because that's a good way for things to uh, be slow. Alright, have a good night, bear. Did I ever play CTR? Yeah, I love CTR. CTR is fantastic. I did runs of NF before. I stopped because it hurt my my hurt my hands too much. Prepare for a big day, Bandicoot. You're ruining my solo. Embryo, do you not recognize your own master? Okay, okay. Last phase is the hardest one. <laughs> Didn't Cortex canonically force Embryo to perfect a cake recipe before he could use it? Yes. Yes, he did. That's in the fucking flashback tapes. <laughs> He's like, I had to make sure I made sure Embryo made it was perfect before he uh, got it. He was like, I revoked Embryo's bathroom privileges until he got it perfect. And he just heard Embryo go, Master, please. Dude, the flashback tapes have some of the best dialogue. It's like half the reason I want to learn the flashback uh, tape category. Just listening to that dialogue again. It was fucking hilarious. I like uh, the, the first time that uh, Engine does a, uh, a... They are, definitely, Kane. But the first time, uh, the first time Engine runs a test, he thinks Coco's a cat, so he's like, Attention, cat! Today I will be running the tests! And he's like, For the last time, she is a bandicoot! Doesn't even look like a bandicoot. 
Yeah, Embryo, the Revivotron. And then, like, in the middle of that same one, Engine just goes, Very good. Have a bowl of milk prepared for if you pass this trial and you just see your core type you've grown in the background. I think at this point, Brio is just like fucking insane from too many potions. Too many toasters. Also, maybe he realized that he needs Crash and Coco's help to overthrow Cortex. I don't know. Brio's dialogue leaves a lot of implications in this game. Reminds me of that fucking, uh, the whole, like, the Twitter trend was like, our relationship should be 50-50, like, you do this, I do that meme, where people were just, like, referencing a bunch of shit, and I made one that was, a relationship should be 50-50, you gather all 42 gems, I focus a laser beam that'll destroy Cortex in the space station that he's created. Ah! That's fine. still fine. It's still fine. I'm still a gamer. Has Brio ever been sane once? Nope. <laughs> Sometimes I think you're my only friends. And then I realize, no, 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 that's right. I, I'm so sad we skipped that line in the run because the, the out of bounds uh, uh, passes the trigger for that. Not enough sudden jerks of movement from Brio's head. True. I hate this fucking... I hate her kick, dude. That shit's more honest than Pit in Smash Bros. You like Crunch, but he isn't relevant to this game? Yeah, he's not in it. I'm not paying attention. It's fine, I still got the cycle. Upon us, footsie game week, it's true. Hana needs to work on her fundamentals. Forgot about Crunch. Oh, gaming! <laughs> nope. It's annoying because it like literally is above her. So if you jump, you, like, miss the enemy. Yes, I love when that happens. I feel like Tana just controls, like, a worse version of Crash and Coco. I mean... She's just different. Eyes on target. You could say Dingo Doll is kind of similar aside from the hover. I don't even think the hook shot is that jank. Like, people always just rag on it, but I haven't had too much issue with it. Crunch is a Nestle product anyway. We don't support... Man. Crunch tastes good, but apparently Nestle's a piece of shit. We should give Tana a slide. Nah. I actually... Part of me kind of likes that they kept the slide exclusive to, like, Crash and Kogo. Cortex is definitely worse than Tana. Definitely. Like, none of the characters are bad. I think there's, like, interesting mechanics to all of them.
Yeah, if Tana's anything, she's like a she's like a reimagined version of Nina in Twin Sanity. Honestly, I think the biggest similarities Tana has to Twat Coco is the fact that she doesn't have a slide and she has a spin kick. But that's about it. But I suppose the only similarity she has to Nina is grappling hook. So, you know. <laughs> and wall jumps. Which were, for Nina, were tied to the grappling hook. Dude, look at that gaming strat. Optimal crawling. Yo, demo. Well, if this dies, I'll, I'll request the help. Because honestly, if this run dies, I don't know if I'll do another one. Just because I am, I'm kind of beat from today. It was just long. Who do we beg for a remake of Twin Sanity with all the uh, nobody? Because I don't want that. Like all things, all all things considered, I. Don't really want that. Somebody raided me. <laughs> Try hex again. Holy shit! <laughs> Thanks, dude. Yo, has anybody found out how to skip this shit yet? Try to yolo all clear gems run today, despite not finishing learning the past world too. Blah, 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 blah. I should read this after Luis. <laughs> Oh, I guess I gotta keep going. <laughs> Alright, please, please hit this. Oh, thank you. Alright, we should be good now. How's any percent grind going? Um, how far did I get the last one? Oh, I, I died on Cortex 1 in the last one. Um, but runs haven't been too bad. I'll take a one second gold. You like my list background? Thank you. Uh, the artist is uh, Wild Blur on Twitter. You should definitely check them out. They're very talented. All right, now I got a world record with uh, approximately 400 people watching. It's got to happen. You just watched the devs react to my speedrun. Oh, how'd you like it? I thought it was a really well done uh, and entertaining video. How did the load remover test go? Uh, it seems like it's doing fine. I got an update for it. That should be more accurate. <sighs> just don't get performance hangs. Honestly... I don't really get that too often. I get test anxiety, like when I have to take like an exam or some shit, which is why I'm glad I don't really do that anymore. But like performance anxiety is nothing I've really had. Hope you're enjoying your view, but oh damn, Ra, how could you do this to me? There's a way to clean that up a little bit. 
Did Embryo fucking murder all the civilians in this country? Uh, don't worry about it. Dog breeds, you know, a rough 14 dog. It's my favorite breed. It is all for science. He says that at the beginning of the boss fight. He's like, for science! All of you need to follow Rico immediately. It's the law! <laughs> Not actually, but I would appreciate it. <laughs> all right, so the dragon on skip is really easily. So naturally, with all these people watching, I'm gonna fuck it up. That's how this works, right? Actually, it's just because Demo is watching. If he if he alone just left, I would get it. <laughs> Case in point, I got it in the last one, and he was at work. Can't make an egg without breaking a few chickens. Dude, Demo, when, if you ever, if we're ever at, like, a speedrunning event together, you gotta make sure we watch all the Tony Hawk movies. <laughs> oh my god, I'm never letting that go. <laughs> I don't, I don't think I could, like, establish just how hard I was laughing at that last night. Raiders of the Lost Park. The half pipe of Doom was also good. How did you even get Tony Hawk out of fucking Indiana Jones? <laughs> Yo, know, he is also a shoe because he hasn't seen Rocket Power. Fucking nerd. Oh, see, it's easy. The demo is like looking away from the screen. That's that's why. What a squid! <laughs> Dude, I do that a lot. As somebody who is already bad with words, I I I, I get the feeling. Mm, maybe not that far. <laughs> yeah, that was kind of clean, though. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Never been to a speedrunning event before, but God, it would be fun. Dude, AGDQ, like the three times I've gone, some of the best weeks of my life. Indiana Jones Underground. Indiana Jones Pro Skater. <laughs> I'd play that. Wanted to run Souls, all bosses, I guess, even again. Dude, I've submitted Crash 2 NST to like every single GDQ and it like never gets in. Well, got in one year, uh, but it wasn't me. I submitted it this year also, so we'll see if it gets in. Even if it's online, it'd be nice to finally have Crash 2 NST any percent of GDQ. Crash 2 is the only one out of like all three games in the Insane Trilogy that hasn't had its any percent run shown, and I think it deserves it. It's gonna be a little faster there. Yeah, fortunately the submissions for HDQ already closed. But depending on how long uh, the world is still on fire, SGQ might be online too. I wonder how close we are to getting a vaccine. That'd be nice. That's not how I wanted to do that.
I am a gamer. I am a gamer. Ah! Sorry. <laughs> And the 24 G's. Oh, this is gonna be a long ride, isn't it? Yeah, that's how I'm feeling about it. Big Pharma wins. It's a rough world we're in right now. Okay. Taking 45 second time loss, just do off of sin. Still having record, got him. I guarantee if I try the skip right now, I'm gonna lose way more than 45 seconds. Plus, I got to do some pretty great parkour. Just play perfect. Yeah, totally. All right, time for easy brio strats that I still haven't looked up. Slow. I didn't get gelatinous fiddlesticks. Enjoy your trip. This one has extra babatulinum. Ooze your way to go. Oh, why? Why don't people take me seriously? I definitely agree, Zed, but lol, United States. We'd be in a much better state if it was handled better. <laughs> The strats. Wrong way. I'll take that. Yup, that is exactly what we're accepting. It makes too much sense. hovers in the air for a split second and is now retired. Yep, that is canonically what happens. <clears throat> you can skip the remaining cutscene of the fight before the movie even starts. Yeah. Yeah, the pace is good, but we're still not even... We're not even halfway through the run. We're like a little over a quarter of a way through, but we're not even at the halfway point, so... Anything can still happen. Just like that.
Oh, I opened the skin menu on accident. I wasn't supposed to, I just mashed X too much. Or triangle too much. Yeah, I'm wondering if it's just worth to just fucking go at that point. I know, I still have to look into this level a lot. I wait on a lot of stuff still. What the f I was hitting X! Oh, uh, cock. Oh, that's bad. That's a long death. Holy shit. Oh, I love this level aesthetically. Speed-wise, it's kinda, kinda sus, though. Caught that cycle, though. It's nice. is fine. Bro. Alright, I've already done a lot, so I'm gonna get safety checks. Oof. That is big time loss. Fucking 45 seconds, dude. <laughs> Let's go! Just like I said, anything could happen. I made all them tablecloths myself. Oh, I made all them tablecloths myself. I do a lot of individual or segment practice before full runs, or was it more on the fly? Um, honestly, I did like time trials and they gave me a basic idea of what the levels looked like. And then I did like a, I did like a semi blind run as in like I'd played the game, but not really in a speed run setting. And then from there, I just like 
figured out like stuff I can do. I'll practice something if I'm particularly struggling with it. For the most part, I really just do runs. Like, I don't really do, like, offline practice or anything. Just serious familiar general experience. It's just how I improve. Like I'm not really someone who's able to like sit down and grind something for hours upon hours. It's like why at the beginning of the uh, of the stream you saw me do off the try the off balance skip for like um for like 30 minutes and then when I couldn't get it I was like I'll just get it later. Like cause I, I've reached a point where I think I just need help getting it so. No amount of like blindly throwing attempts at it is gonna make me better at it at this point. <laughs> How do you like them, Wampus? It's because bandicoots are fast. Let's go. <sighs> Let's go. Dingle dongle. Oh my god. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button! I was hitting triangle! Where are my time saves now? Yes. Everywhere. I don't I don't know. <laughs> I don't even remember how my run yesterday went. Oh, the final hub was bad. I do remember that. Final hub was like choke city. Yeah, like in in like in like Smash, I'm not a labber either. I just like playing games and learn very slowly, but learn eventually. I think it's because like, at the end of the day, my enjoyment comes from playing the game. So when I'm like actively engaged by playing a game, I, I pick up on stuff better than if I'm like specifically looking for something. Th there are times where I will sit down and practice one specific thing. But it's not often compared to just like doing runs and getting used to getting used to being in the situation of doing a run. It's probably why I like I don't really cave under pressure either, because I'm just like I'm used to this. Ah And then I almost died of the fucking Metro Bats. No, Crash and Coco are identical in the speed. for the Bandicoots to make it out into Ultimate. Crash, at least. I always joke that, like, the, they're gonna release Crash with, like, a Coco Echo Fighter. Which, I don't think will actually happen, but that'd be funny. Do good guys even have Volcano Lairs? Much to learn. I used to be good at not hitting anything there, and then something went wrong somewhere. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, this is something I forgot to practice. He's jumping over the last set of barrels. I knew there was something else that I saw Demo do that I wanted to pick up. There was... 
Because the, there's the thing in Crash Compactor, which I did start doing. There was the going to the right in Booty Calls. And then there was, like, there was one more thing, and that was it. It was um, jumping over the last set of barrels. Fake Crash as an Echo. Fake Crash as an alternate skin would be good. They could also do like what they did with like Steve, where like there was Steve and Alex and Zombie and Enderman. That skip seems busted for time trials. From what I've heard, it's actually not useful in the trials because he skips so many time crates. I'm not sure though. Because Crash is cool. Also, I can't let I can't let Hypno have another victory like that. Too much Dingo Dollar exposure is gonna be uh, too much for his uh, for his uh, ego. Can't let Hypno have an ego. I don't know why we just can't. Dingo Dial Explosor will raise his blood pressure to a dangerous state. Yeah, he might even explode if Dingo Dial gets announced. In Smash. You know how you know how hard like Hypno like pops off and like screams into his mic. Imagine if Dingo was in Smash, he might actually just blow up on stream. I keep, I, cra I keep trying to do it on the the first one when I should do it on the second one. I don't know. I need to I need to refresh these cycles in my head because I definitely have been messing them up. Dude, I'm so critical of my Snow White Alice just because of the demo. Fucking like how? I wonder if they made that harder. I bet they made that harder. Totally not me being bad. It's, it's the game's fault. Could it be that I've just forgotten how to do the level? No, it's the game that's wrong. And Flash was near the kid, and then you could switch to a character that isn't crass when you chose Cortex and saw Uku Uku appear instead of Akko. Fuck me up for the whole day. Jesus. Yeah, damn it. Look at all these strats that you that have been at your fingertips since before the game came out. Just don't try the cutscene skip that I do in the demo. That doesn't exist in the final version, sadly. It was pretty hype. It was pretty hype. And then the, the devs saw it and they're like, oh, that's the thing we fixed. And I was like, assholes! Oh. Am I critical of my dino dash? No, that was fucking hard. Donald Dash is hard as shit. I intentionally play that shit safe. Oh, I knew it. I knew that was a thing. Totally just winged that shit. Oh, well, fuck. Yee!
Yo, Josh. Polar, yep. So mad that Cookie Face hasn't been approved yet. work on that a little bit. the best place I can basically say when 43 is doable. Yeah, because I still don't do the off-balance skip, and that's like 40 seconds or something. And then, like, obviously there's just gonna be more minor optimizations down the road. Like, by just, like, doing runs and just, like, getting better movement, my time just keeps going down a lot. But I've already, already shaved, like, 20 seconds off of it just tonight, and I haven't even gotten through half of the game in a run yet. not terrified of this section. So we get to hear Cortex's giggles, which is uh -huh. Someone just mod the game to replace Cortex's laughs with just like Ed from Ed and Eddie. You'll never catch me, Crash. Not when I shift into maximum overdrive. And you get to get to the boss fight. I knew I should have gotten the turbo. It's like he was never clinically depressed in Crash Warp. He, he got the woman with nice big bags of ice for his head. Oh, well, oops. <laughs> giant, deadly missiles. giant hidden missiles. Eleven Dimension's cool. I also like that it's it's honestly a bit of a breather before like the rest of the run. Like it's a pretty chill run. And it's a pretty chill hub in the in the context of the run. Hmm. 
I wonder what happens if I hit all the buttons at It's a fun It's a fun boss, but it's uh It's hard in the run. I've killed more than a few runs here. What hub is chill? Uh, the eleventh, the, the one we were just in, the snow one. I think overall it's probably the easiest hub, in my opinion. Yeah, that was a pretty good Cortex one. I played it a couple of the early phases safer than normal, but didn't really matter too much. The voice crack during that line just like adds such a nice touch to it. Dude, imagine we just didn't have to wait on those though. How great it would be. Cortex had a grinding section, that would be a great reference, but he doesn't. Fruit salad, Jesus. That's a throwback. Let's see how these prehistoric predators like my blaster's new settings. <laughs> they laughed when I added blockification. Well, who's laughing now? <laughs> Me. Me. That always terrifies me. God, go fucking down, you stupid bug. But I'll fucking die there. Almost. Ooh, I've never tried a volcano lair. Do good guys have volcano lairs? I... yeah. Okay. Let's 
totally is not a bad level in any way whatsoever. Just imagine though, if Cortex had auto aim. Mushrooms that big since I left the Gigantizotron running overnight. I think they made it so the line doesn't repeat. That way you don't hear it over and over when you do die. Like it's inconvenient when you die in the middle of a when you die in the middle of a dialogue, but I don't really think it's a necessary fix. Haven't seen mushrooms that big since college. Favorite mu music in the game? Mine is... I keep hitting triangle, dude. Um, yeah, it's either Off Balance, Jetboard Jetty, or... Actually, it's probably one of those two. <laughs> probably Off Balance. Oh, ship happens. That's a pretty good one, yeah. Here are your, here are your ACG strats. Yeah, sh ship happens. Oh, you're talking about the one that, the one with the parallel, the one with the yellow jump path is uh. Actually, while I'm thinking about it, I also I really like the music in Toxic Tunnels. Talking about the one that I think has the yellow jump path. That's uh, Stay Frosty, I think. No, 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 it's Bears Repeating. No! Is this a problem? I thought it was bears. I thought it was bears repeating. Oh, the snow. Yeah, no, that is stay frosty. Yeah, the, the snow go notes was a good touch. I'm too slow! Every time, just too slow in the last phase. I need to practice this because I've forgotten how to do it. This game's metal as shit. Let's go. May 
my assist? Yeah, if you want. Yeah, Alpha Launch has good music also. Like, th there's actually a lot of good songs in this game. Like, everybody's like, oh, the soundtrack's not that great. I'm like, oh, I gotta listen to more. You ever, you ever been with somebody and you're like, hey, you want some parfait? And you're like, no, I don't want parfait. Parfait is delicious. Our fan might be the best thing on the whole damn planet. I mean, it definitely sounds a lot different from the original soundtrack, but I still think it's good. It's very fitting with the levels, and I also like how dynamic it all is. Yo, Boucher, thanks for the good luck. I'm like, get 106. Fuck, dude. Can't believe it got reset now. You don't get skins from the inverted specifically. Each level has a certain number of gems you have to collect between both the normal version and the inverted versions. Yeah, when the number of gems go past six, it includes the uh, inverted gems. plans to learn the run for all clear just oh yeah no I, i'm gonna learn it i just want to i want a good time in any percent first or rather a time in any percent i am satisfied with because my time is honestly not that bad um <laughs> but i i want i want to push any percent more 
If I get to the point where I'm either happy with this or I want to take a break from it, I'll start learning ACG. But I do definitely want to learn it because it seems like a good category. Oh yeah, I died in this level. Yeah, a lot of people will ask me if I'm going to do like all clear. Some people ask me if I'm going to do a 106. I'm just like, ha ha. You don't do 106. 106 does you. And where's, where's the lie, dude? 106 seems like a very special occasion. Category. Definitely, that's 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 an annual race kind of category. 106 is like a 12 to 16 hour run. I feel like optimized. It could probably get close to 10, but <laughs> that's gonna be a while. No, it's gonna be a really fucking long run. No, 106 is longer than 315. Three fifteen, if you're fast, is six and a half to seven hours. You don't even have to be super fast. I I have like a um I have a high six in uh, a, a high six hour run in um three fifteen, and like my runs aren't even like that great. I'm beating the record. Well, the record is my time, and I'm ahead of it right now, so. One oh five, it's like a full scratch back. I didn't mean 106, but yeah. Honestly, it might be as long as a full scratch factor. Actually, no, I think it. Scratch factor is what, 12 hours? So yeah, 106 is probably about as long as a scratch factor. Tim, please bust the run. Let's go, Tim. Tim coming in clutch. Ah! Uh, that's my Tarzan impression. But I think the real question is, uh, what's what's faster, or what's uh, or what what's longer, 106 or Super Mario Galaxy 2 uh, 242 star? Isn't that like oh, uh, that's like world record for that's like what nine hours? Oh, I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up bad. Yes, 242 is included in 602 runs. I know this because 240, 602 is part of the 1545. And 242 is definitely part of the 1545. My George of the Jungle impression? Uh, probably the same thing. Crash 421 versus 3D Mario 6. You know, that might actually be tight. <laughs> actually, no, no. I think the Mario one's still longer. Because, like... I think in the Mario 602, the only run that's like quote unquote short is SM64. Because SM64 is like, what, a little under two hours? Um. But like Sunshine and Galaxy 1 are both like five hours, right? Five to six? 
Whereas, like, sure, like, 106 is stupidly long in Crash 4, but, like, Crash 1 through 3 in the Insane Trilogy, they're all, like, two, they're all in the range of two hours. The longest one is 108, and it's two hours and, like, ten minutes, probably, on average. Yeah, Mar yeah, Mario 602 is, like, 20 hours. Yeah, Sunshine and Galaxy 1 are still long. They're not as long as Galaxy 2, but they're still long. They're longer than any Crash game. Oh, I forgot to switch Crash, so I guess we're getting the bad, uh... We're getting the bad, uh, meme. We can just not get the meme at all. That's also an option. You know, I might take the break. Let's take a break. Yep, not even getting it. Interdimensional domination. Something, something, something monumentally stupid. Not, not, not from our universe. Has only plays himself reached the wall me Easter egg? Yeah, probably. Kick some, kick some, kick some. Yeah, he he started the wall meme and he dates that he did. Are considered pests. They're fit for extermination as a housefly. Oh, how modern. Tell me. Some more. keep them as pets, but I find it disgusting. I much prefer. Hmm, yes. So elegant. Little eggs to pull. Ooh. Oh, ho, ho, saved! <laughs> Fucking saved! Found its way home. Let's put them down. Activate the security lasers. Enough! I won't be foiled by a flea bag. Time to die. Take those. I think the trophies are fucking wherever they were transported. The trophies are fucking wherever they were transported after they are beaten. I don't know. Maybe. I try not to think about it.
Enjoy the end of the universe. I should mess with that rope section a little more. See if I can do it faster. Because Ika Ika lets you do some crazy shit. Dude, we're so close to 143. Does the Ika Ika skip save time here? Um, which one? The one I didn't do or the one I did do? <laughs> yeah, that food run was good. The last one. So the one I didn't do. Um, the, there's like a place you can land on that does make it faster, but if you don't do all of it, it's uh, it doesn't save any time. I think it actually loses some. Just because like going over everything is a lot slower than just like phasing through it with Lonnie Lo or yeah, Lonnie Lolly. on my nose. Because I saw my future franchise. Oh, bollocks, my head hurts. Yeah, I have a lot of time save across the entire run. I hope it's spicy and fried. Like, there's still so much time I can save. That's why I'm trying not to reset if I can help it.
God, I don't need the robot for that. So Dingo Dial's retired, so he opened up a restaurant. Like he retired from villainy and was and had opened up a diner. The start of his cutscene is a commercial for his diner. And then I guess like some competitors or something like blow it up. Um and then when he's going to like fend them off, he gets sucked into the alternate dimensions. So he's kind of just like he's involved in the story by accident. I think it's kind of cool. Sounds like Mafia story. Pinstrike confirmed for Crash 5, true. It took me a couple watches to figure it out myself, but like I had to listen to the dialogue a second time to fully get it. DLC? Eh, there's a pretty good chance. Yeah, I think there's a good chance of DLC happening. I don't know if I want to believe that there's this was a really good uh, crate escape. Seems too good to be true.
Definitely the fastest I've ever done that. Ah, oh, fuck it. <laughs> At least it was right after a checkpoint. Trash traps were fast. I think that alone might save a lot of time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that the fast trash rats definitely saved a lot there. And now for me to stop me. Alright. I can still choke this in the last hub, but hopefully that doesn't happen. But I, I know this nitro processing was like especially bad. Yeah, 143 is some of the best. It's pretty hype. We'll never know what he looks like. We'll never know that he's a bona fide 10 because I went way too fast. Too fast for dialogue. E E E F G. Thanks for the good luck, Sandry. Uh, sub 130 with load remover is probably possible. But it won't be this run. I think my sum of best before this was like a 130... Like a low 130. I don't know what it is now. I can check after the run. Yeah, I don't trust that. I want a little slow. Yeah, the Ika Ika deload bypass is great. Yeah, it's super broken. Is this doable in other levels? Uh, there's a couple spots where you can do it, but that's like the most notable case where you can uh, dodge the Ika Ika thing. Uh, you can dodge the Econo drop in uh, off balance as well, which is part of what, how the skip happens. Oh, that was good. All right, so if Toxic Tunnels and Cortex Castle go well, then it'll be it'll be fine.
Yeah, I, I say that a lot of the time, even over like my best seg. So hopefully Toxic Tunnels and Cortex Castle and Cortex go well, and then uh, we're in for something good. That being said, Toxic Tunnels is not easy. So, we'll see. Yo, Lost Bar, thanks for the luck. I thought that bat was gonna kill me. Those bats are actually like super annoying. I mean, Toxic Tunnels has strategy to it also, it's just not easy. Also, I'm really glad I got that jump because it's the first time I've done that in a run. It's mostly these bats that are scary, and I sniped both of them, so we're good. Toxic Tunnels does have a lot going on for sure. Oh, 
Yeah, this stage is really cool. Do you not recognize your own master? I'm the real Cortex. No, Enrio, I am. Ding dong, ding dong. Oh my, sounds like the doorbell. I'd better go see what it is. I was a little too greedy there. Well, the only thing I really missed there was the uh, the damage abuse because I lost the mask early. <sighs> okay, so that can obviously be improved even more. All right, it's all down to Cortex. I specifically made sure I didn't do that, Jimbo. I was so scared that I was like, what if I just accidentally pick seeing double? I don't know, it's great, Stardust. I just just shat out a pretty solid run. Oh my god, I thought I was gonna die.
Oh my god, dude! <laughs> Dude, I think that was a really big, like, loadless one also. That was a three-minute loadless PB. Holy fuck. <laughs> okay. I think I can say with pretty solid confidence that even loadlessly, this is record. <laughs> This was really solid. Like, the beginning sucked, and like stuff in the middle was like not bad, but the entire end game was just really good. Holy fuck. Yo, Rip, thanks for the sub. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, that's gonna be a pain in the ass to run against for the end game. Oh lord. How I feel? Ah. Oh. That, 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 that's how I feel, just ah. Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh boy. <laughs> it was it was the trihex raid. That that's what did it. It was the trihex raid. I was like, okay, now I got a record. <laughs> Holy shit, that was good. Now time for cockpit. What the fuck is cockpit? <laughs> 